Hey guys, uh, hello and welcome to today's video. So in today's video, um, I open up another tin of 22-23 Hockey Series wine. And uh, again, hoping to get a Beneers uh, Young Guns. But I also have four bonus packs. So uh, yeah, and they, you know, I think I did very good overall. So let's, uh, let's see what that means. And let's get right to it. Okay, uh, let's get right to it. And this is likely the last in I'm going to be opening up uh, because Series 2 is coming out very, very, very shortly. Uh, I believe it's next week. So next week is just in a few days. So yeah, last chance. Please be in here. Please. Okay. Starting this pack. And then we have these packs here. Um, you know what? I'm going to open up the glossy first. I want to change this up. So again, I want I want the veneers. I've just had horrible luck. Maybe changing this up will help with my luck. Uh, I'm sure the answer to that is no, but uh, I don't have that much power over the universe, but we shall see. All right, so we've got an Eric Cal Green Glossy Rookie, and that is the Paradol. Then we have a Noah Cates and an Owen Power. Okay, well, that's a good uh, Glossy Rookie to get. Definitely one of the top ones to get, that's for sure. So we'll start with the packs on this side, which is the side that the glossy pack was in. So our first base card is a Linus Hallmark, a Thatcher Demko, Shea Theodore, so Martin Neckes. I think it's some kind of rookie retrospective, maybe. Jar Kara. I'm horrible at uh, predicting the inserts. Tanner Pearson. Alex Nedelkovic. You would think I would know by now, considering how many of these tins I've opened. Um, okay, it is a rookie retrospective, and it's a Lucas Raymond. Okay, so that's not a bad one to get. I would love to get a, a Caulfield or a Zegris. But I'm okay with that. So I don't know if I've pulled a rookie retrospective from the Tins yet. But I think this might have been the first one. Okay, let's get on to the next pack. We've got Antonisa Rally, Sean Carley, Danielle Sprung, Matt Grosick. UD portraits behind that. Dante Fabro. Jacob Silverberg. Daniel Nurse. And finally, Jonathan Herberdo. Next pack. So we still haven't hit any of the young guns. There should be a couple of them. So, Alexander Barkov and Braden Point Checklist. Tyler Myers. Ryan Hartman. So, I believe that is a Young Guns behind that. Uh, Timo Meyer. Nick Smolt. Pavel Frankos. Mackenzie Wegar. And finally, we have Mark Kastelik. Not Beneers. So I should call them all Not Beneers from now on. Ah. So Not Beneers, 100% of the Young Guns. Michael Madison. Frederick Anderson. Jack Roslovic, 
Joel Armia. Oh, this might be a Young Guns Retro. Sean Dersey. Or Canvas, sorry. Uh, Henry Yokiarju. Ryan Johnson. And finally, Samuel Fagamo. Okay, well that's that means an extra Young Guns in this tin, so I have to be happy with that. But I will just not be happy enough unless I get veneers. So David Pasnak, Dylan Strone, Matthias Hecklum, Adam Pellet. Troy Terry, Carter Hart, Olivier Killington, and finally the debut dates of Quinton Byfield. Okay, that's a nice one to have. Very nice. Next pack. So I, you know what? If I compare, you know, this year's Series One with last year's, uh. In, I think in terms of value, but also in, time, in terms of how fun the breaks are, uh, I would go with Series 1 from last year, especially with the prices dropping. So we've got a Jeff Carter base, Johnny Goudreau, or at least where I am, I'm able to get them cheaper than uh, Series 1 of this year. Uh, Carter Varhig, Rasmin Ristolani, Ristolanen, sorry. Mitch Marner, uh, John Carlson, Sean Couturier, and finally, Logan Couture, Orange Dazzlers. Two packs to go. There should be one more of the regular Young Guns. I believe this is the pack that will have it. I, I believe it's always that bottom one. So, Alexander Barkov, Kale Clagg, Chris Kreider, Warren Fogel, sorry, Barrett Hayton, I think I was wrong, I think it's this one, uh, William Carrier, Philip Dano. And finally, we have a Jack McBain's Young Guns. So, yeah, no veneers. Uh, unless this pack is somehow a fluke. But I did get a canvas Young Gun, so I have to be happy with that. But I'm still disappointed. So. Nathan Bastion, Denny Goriano, Jacob Markstrom, Igor Sharkaraz, Govic, sorry, uh, William Nylander, Jesper Bratt, Andrew Shrevskinov, and finally we have a Braden point UD canvas so just one second okay so I have a bit of a bonus uh, now uh, I don't usually buy just you know loose packs like this but I decided to buy these four loose packs we have a 2021 metal universe and then the second one and then I got an SP authentic and finally a artifacts now I've already opened these so, I, I mean, I'm not going to be surprised by what I got, um, but I kept them uh, the way, well, I may have reordered the cards in them, but uh, what's in each pack is what I got in each pack. So, uh, let's see what I got in this first pack here. So, we're starting with a John Tavares. So, this is my first time opening out the Metal Universe. Uh, I'm assuming this is just a regular, you know, card. Uh, we've got a Miro Heskinen. And then we have a big 
Is it big five? Big man on ice. Oh, sorry. Uh, Brad Marchand. Then we have a John Gibson. Cole Lind. Oh, this one's a rookie card. Let me quickly double check here if there was any other ones. No. Uh, Anze Kapitar. Thomas Hartle. So not, you know, in terms of loose pack, not, not great, but I did get a rookie card, I guess. But I think it's probably one rookie card per pack. I wouldn't be surprised. So we have a Evgeny Malkin on the second loose pack of these. Then we have a Patrick Kane. Finally, we have a retro of Grigory Denisenko. Or I'm assuming this is a retro. Then we have a Cole Caulfield rookie card. So, uh, considering I collect Cole Caulfield, I'm very happy with getting his rookie card here. And you know what? When I opened this, I did not even realize, I didn't see the uh, rookie card here. And I didn't pay attention that this was 21-22 because 22-22 he started rolling out. But it's just, upper deck is just really late with 21-22 products. So I'm very happy with getting Cole Caulfield rookie card here. So that is just awesome. All right, so next we have Ilya Sorokin, Brock Bozer, and finally a Carey Price. All right, so yeah, definitely my uh, top pack so far. And next I open the SP Authentic. So let's see what I get out of this pack. So we have a John Gibson and then yes there was another John Gibson I'm assuming it's the same card uh, Jonathan Huberdeau then we have a Victor Hedman I'm assuming this is a retro then so I guess I just have to show it so the very nice looking future wa future watch here that's no auto unfortunately Vitek Vanisek, but very, very nice. Uh, and there's two layers to this. So you can you tell here from the thickness. So very nice, clear. So I don't know what the, uh, the odds are on this. And like I said, they're not numbered. So I think John Gibson, as far as I can tell, these are two base. So there was two of the same base card in the same pack. So I definitely, uh, you know, as a loose pack, uh, I don't think I can complain there. So next, this was the best pack that I got, the artifacts. And uh, this, like I said, just from a bay, it's just from a, a random pack. I'm definitely really happy with this. So I'm going to show you that card last. So we have a Yegor Sharakovic. And then we have... A John Marino. Of course, you know, you have to have one of these. Now, Jason Robertson, and behind Jason Robertson, what do we have? We have an Archer Kaliev Artifacts, Artifacts Auto. Unfortunately, it's not on card, but, uh, you know, from opening a single pack, I'm very happy with this. Um, I haven't even purchased 2223. Uh, artifacts um, maybe when you know if the price drops I will but uh, at the moment I don't plan on you know shelling out whatever the cost is for a box uh, I mean uh, quit while you're ahead because I mean I already got this card so to me that's uh, that's pretty good out of one pack uh, all right so I will be right back with the highlights of today's break Okay, so I'm back with the highlights of today's break. So we're starting with a UD canvas of Braden Point. So, um, you know, if you watch the uh, video by now, you know that not only did I open a uh, thin of 22-23 Series 1, uh, but I also had four loose packs that, uh, unfortunately, I had already uh, opened off camera. Um, but uh, I showed you what the cards were. Uh, and I still ended up having a surprise because it was a card that I didn't think was a rookie. And when I looked at it again here, it was a rookie and it's one of my favorite players. So 
uh, I'm very happy with that. So, and as you can guess, it will be the last highlight of this break. So let's just get right to it. So we have a Jonathan Huberdeau UD Portraits. We have a Big Man on Ice, Brad Marchand. A Lucas Raymond, Rookie Retrospective. Logan Couture, Dazzler's Orange. Debut Dates, Quinton Byfield. A SP Authentic, this was from the Metal Universe of Victor Hedman. Then we have a Retro Metal Universe, Grigory Denisenko. Uh, Cole Lind, Rookie Card. Owen Power, Glossy Rookie. Noah Cates. Then we have a Parallel, Eric Callgren. Then we have a Uni Canvas, Young Guns of Samuel F Fagamo. Um, then the Young Gun of Mark Kastelik. And Jack McBain. Then we have a Future Watch of Vi Vitek Vanisek. Archer Kaliev, Autofax. And finally, this is, to me, this is the highlight as far as I'm concerned, just because uh, I'm a big fan of Cole Caulfield and I'm collecting his cards right now. So, a Cole Caulfield Metal Universe rookie card. Very nice. Very happy with, uh, you know, this opening overall. Um, if you enjoyed it, please click the like button. Don't forget to subscribe. And until next time, uh, have a great day, guys. Bye.